This is the Platinum Camo in Pixel Strike 3D. It's a camo you unlock when you've killed 10,000 players with a specific gun you use. And 10,000 kills sounds like overkill, which it is. It's not fun at all, bro. And it may take weeks, maybe a month, or maybe six months to accomplish this mastery. But today, I will show you how to unlock this camo on every weapon within 10 days. If you guys enjoyed today's video, let's get 30 likes and subscribe for more Pixel Strike Duty videos. But let's stop wasting time. Let's begin the grind. But first, I feel like we need a... Now, when you're grinding for this mastery camo, you're gonna need a strategy, not just for the amount of kills you wanna get in a single session, but also a strategy that keeps you from jumping off the roof of your very home. Oh my God! So we're gonna have to break down the kills. If your math is mathing, then yes, in order to get this challenge done in 10 days or less, is by getting a thousand kills a day. Now I know that sounds impossible, but if you play the right mode and or right map, which we will get into later, I'm sure you'll be fine. Now let's talk about the playtime. Now, I'm sure some of you don't have the time to spare. I'm sure some of you got school and everything, but I'm telling you right now, fuck school. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That shit is not important right now. The mastery grind is all that matters. That's why you click the video. Let me show, dog. <laughs> Yo, yo, uh, school's important, I, I guess. that It's a joke, stop. But if somehow you manage to finish your homework in class, or if you've already graduated and you don't have a job and you don't go to school and you have all the time in the world, then you should spend at least one or two hours trying to get 500 kills in that session. So we're talking like two hours in the morning, maybe two hours in the afternoon or evening. So four hours a day, you should be able to get a thousand kills, a thousand plus kills. And maybe you can probably kill that within maybe less than four hours. I don't know. Maybe drink a little caffeine, eat a brownie, get your sugar up. Then it's probably not a problem. Now it's time for one of the most important parts of the video and that is the now Pixel Strike Duty has a lot of maps to choose from some of those maps you can get in the mix as fast as possible and others you can sightsee or strike so it is important choosing the right map for the weapon you decided to go platinum on for or whatever the fuck. Now, if we're talking ARs, SMGs, shotties, LMGs, pistols, or even melee weapons, you're gonna want to choose the maps that have the most interactions, like these maps, and not these maps at all, like ever, bro. Now, there are a few maps that are valid, but I wouldn't choose those over the must play maps. But unfortunately, we have no choice, we have no freedom in this game at all bro we are forced to play the maps that we despise what an amazing game we play y'all <laughs> now for snipers and maybe marksman rifles you're definitely going to want to pick some of those bigger maps if you're not as skilled with the sniper by all means camp your ass off just don't kill me though you know i'm on the grind too and now for the most important part of the video that just has to be spoken about the fucking modes the fastest way to get your gun platinum is not only just playing the right map, but the right mode. There are three mandatory modes you will have to play. TDM, free for all, and the best mode for this challenge, capture the flag. Capture the flag is definitely the best mode for this grind because you don't have to worry about players fucking up your flow by picking fucking gun game. Can we all agree to stop? picking gun game in the middle of our free-for-all TDM session, bro. That shit is annoying. There is barely any progress to do in that mode. That mode is fucking pointless. Stop being a selfish piece of shit and stop picking gun game. And capture the flag may be the best mode due to the duration and the player count, but there are certain people that just love playing the fucking objective. Yeah, yeah, this part, this video is for you, the bot. The noob that just that just wants to win so bad. Okay, well look here, bot noob. Winning and losing does not matter in this game. There's no reward for winning. There's no penalty for losing. If we have two flags with 11 minutes of playtime, then stop 
playing the fucking objective. Get some fucking kills under your belt, big bro. Get some X. P, bro. It's like, come on. Like, we're trying to unlock camels, and all you want to do is win? <laughs> really? All you want to do is just, oh, look at me. We won. Yay. We did it. Yay. Let's go eat cheese balls. Yay. <laughs> Cut that shit out. Cut that shit the fuck out, you fuck. <laughs> So if you follow these tips and tricks, you will unlock Platinum Camel in no time. And while you're on this grind, by all means, turn off your brain. You need to brain dead this whole grind. You need to you need to be immune to all the bullshit that Pixel Strike 3D provides. Dying to an RPG a thousand times does not matter. Losing a multiple matches do not matter. What matters is how many kills you get. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let's get 30 likes and let me know if this video helped in any way. And if you have any tips, pause, feel free to let me know your strat on how to unlock Platinum Camel in the comments below or on Discord. The, my Discord's in the description, okay? I love you all. I'll catch you all later. If Red is out. Ah!